Hey guys, and welcome back to <coughs> The Ring. When we last left off, uh, we were exploring the underground and finding some information out from these patients. Now, we're not really finding a lot of information out, just that they're infected with some kind of virus. Uh, they're locked in the basement. They don't know why they're locked in the basement, apart from the fact that they're waiting to die. Meg. Oh, Jesus, look at these people. Can you spare a minute? What are you guys doing here? We know what they're doing, Meg. They're waiting to die. You're going to treat us here, right? We're the ones you... Uh, you were the ones who brought us here. They were brought by people from the slab. Yes, Meg! We know this! I'm sorry. Uh, that was right. By the way, how is the treatment? I have nothing to say. Take us back soon. I have to go home. My kids are waiting for me. Your kids? You look like a zombie. To the back? Huh? To the back corridor. There's an ICU over there, right? I've heard that they won't let us in until five days after we get here. Oh. Me, it doesn't look so full that you have to make us wait that long. To the back ICU after five days. You're right. I'll see if I can uh, let you go in earlier. Hey, we're going to be okay, right? We're not going to die, right? Die? What is she saying? I feel... I feel... A fucking headache coming on. <laughs> what is she saying? Of course you're going to be alright. Don't be silly. But a lab member of this place died recently too, right? I heard it was a rumour. But Robert, who came here often, doesn't come here at all anymore. Isn't Robert the one that died? Robert was here? Dun dun dun! Hey, are you listening? Bring Robert here. I want to talk to him like before. Please. Alright. Next time. Next time I'll bring him with me. Really? Thank you. I was slightly worried because I'm going back there soon. The rumour is that you die after seven days if Robert is alright. I'll be alright too. If Robert is alright? What do you mean? If Robert is alright. Don't get mad at me. I just heard that from Robert. But I'll be alright if he's alright. That he's alright because he shot a vaccine. He shot a vaccine. Why did he shoot the vaccine? Robert shot a vaccine? Impossible. Impossible? Robert's fine, right? He's fine, right? What does this mean, Robert? What happened to you? Hey, are you listening? Robert is fine, right? Yes, he's fine. He's alright. Robert, tell me. Anyway, have you heard anything else from him? Anything? You ask questions like that, Chief. I'm a patient. I haven't heard anything. Chief? What do you mean? That oh, this is crap. Oh, this dialogue is awful. Ah, uh, Chief asked you about Robert. What did he ask? What is up with this? I just told him that I wanted the same vaccine that he gave Robert. Chief is hiding something. That just can't be. How do you... You've been here less than a day. But the Chief... I'm sorry. I got so excited. But you helped me out a lot. Wait. Are we really alright? Did something happen to Robert? Yes. There's nothing wrong. I'm sure. I'm sure that you'll be all right. Don't worry and stay here. Well, you can't really do anything else. Okay then. Oh, this dialogue. It's so bad. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I guess we can go to the microscope room. How can they use so many sentences to essentially say nothing? steps. Damn it! Someone's coming! I have to hurry and hide somewhere. Is there some place I can hide? Uh, in the locker? <laughs> really? Oh, good god. I see. That's even better news. What's... That's it. Now I can have complete control of it in the near future. But no virus has ever been this powerful. Can't make fun of magic in Asia. It's not magic. 
Hatred, yes, it's a curse. A powerful one at that. One that was built up in a well for over 30 years. Oh, yes. I'm sorry, that's right. Anyway, now the virus has been confirmed, controlling it is a matter of time. Yeah. We can't have nonsense like that failure last time. Well, that was useful in itself. Useful? Chief, then you did... You used it on them? Oh, I didn't really know. Anyway, hurry up. Hey, what? We've come this far. It's only a little more. Uh, oh yes, I understand. I think I can finish it in one more day. Yeah, I'm counting on you. Okay, so there is a vaccine? And the chief used it on other people, but he's not really sure if he used it. Those two, what are they doing? But if the chief is here now, I can have a quick look in his offices. For now, I should hurry up. Look in the chief's office. Yeah, she just said the same thing twice. Right, well, I mean, I guess there's nothing here. Okay, let's go. Oh, is there anything in that? Oh, huh, yes, there is. Take the healing jelly. Kind of want to have a look around, though. Where is the chief, then? Or is he just, like, magically disappeared? Op opera room. Op room. This isn't a very advanced facility, is it? Considering this is, like, you know... Control center for viruses and shit. Actually, let's go back into that room. Was there anything above the cabinet? I didn't see anything up there. This music is just shite as well. Absolute shit. Ugh. I think that's the trouble, just like everything about this game, you know, it's not just it's got a shit feature here or, you know, a bad idea there, just the whole package is just dog shit. That's the trouble. Oh, I guess we've got more people in here. More, more. There's a lot of people with this virus, apparently. I mean, we've got to be talking about nearly 10 people. Oh my god. All because they played the video game? Yes? Not really very clear. Is it the video game? That... Is that why they're infected? Or is it because they knew people that were infected? Oh, there's just... Nothing is clear. Let me have the mouse on the screen. Noticed. Okay. I'm guessing we can't go... Yeah, we can't go back there yet. That's fine. So have we been in all of these rooms? I think so. At least most of them. At least all the rooms that we... Yeah, we have, actually. Okay. So we can't go into that one to the north. Hmm. Right, let's go back. Let's go check the chief's officers. I bet he's going to find us and, like, he's going to, I don't know, strap us down in one of these bloody hospital beds and... Uh, inject us with all kind of things. Probably give us the virus. That wouldn't surprise me. And now, can we actually go through here? No, we can't. At least not yet, anyway. I don't understand why there's no lights in this corridor. But, I mean, they have referenced the film now a couple of times in a file. Now he was mentioning the well. Harboring a grudge. For 30 years? I mean, I'm sure 30 years is a long time. Uh, you know, to harbor a grudge, that's quite a significant time. Uh, transmission. Right, let's just get out of here. Are we going to bump into that absolute unit again? Are you going to whinge at us? What are you doing in the chief room? Snooping. What's it to you, pal? All right. Let's go upstairs. Set upstairs, Meg. 
We have no idea where the chief is either. We have no idea how much time we're going to have to fiddle around in his room. Although maybe we can go into the next room. Okay, so here we are. Very fancy room. Nice heating system there. Lovely. Right. Oh, small key. Uh, yeah. If I have this key, it looks like I can open many things. I remember there was a drawer that didn't open in the reference room. Anyway, I have to get out of here before the chief comes back. Right. I can open many things with this key. Okay. So I guess we can get like the healing gels and stuff. Is there anything in here? What's this? That's nothing, son. Ooh. Important file. Research notes concerning the virus. The virus has been confirmed from the corpse which we recently started analysing. Sadly, the virus found was smallpox, believed to be extinct, different from the virus that we have been eagerly researching for. Researching for. Uh, the investigation from the investigation we confirm date of death. It looks like we must say that Looks like we must say that what was on the report was true right. Anything else in here Keep forgetting about this uh, like first-person camera although we can't actually turn around you can only see, you know, Meg Bone actually turn her head. Very lazy like that. But hey, we've got the key. Wasn't there actually a fair few things that we could open with that key? Memory serves. I mean, before we actually go complete this in the briefing room, there were some other lockers and locked doors and things that we could fiddle with, I think. There's definitely something in... Yeah, there was a load of healing gels and, and shit we could get. Have a look in here. I'm just going to go back and search every day. Uh, right. Wait a minute. Ah, right, so it doesn't say you're using the key. It just opens the doors. So, I mean, profit? Right, what else can we look at? Nobody here. Yeah, because I'm sure there was like other doors, uh, like another drawer somewhere. I mean, there's an awful lot. Oh, we can go through here now. There is an awful lot of areas and uh you know items that we can actually open that just literally have nothing in is really annoying nothing in there so many chemicals what do we use them for oh i don't know maybe research maybe oh hang on bullets yeah because i think that was locked as well wasn't it memory serves what do we use all these chemicals for in a research lab? Uh, she really is just like an intern or something, isn't she? I think she only... She literally just got the job because her boyfriend died. And she was like, well, I know things about stuff. And then she's like, yeah, fuck it. All right, give her a job. Let's see what she can do. What has she managed to do so far? Apart from fuck everything up. Oh, the map. I guess we'll take the map. I'm guessing... Okay, for some reason we can't open that locker. I'm guessing this key is opening all these doors. I don't know what's going on in this room. I don't know why... I don't know why um, this one boring ass key would be so universally useful. I go here. Now it looks like we need actual card keys for these doors, but we've already unlocked them, so hey ho, dimly deep. 
think of anywhere else. Locker room, women. Is there anything that was locked in here? I don't think so. Uh, let's have a fiddle. Right. Uh, it's rather lonely in here. Yeah, I know. I know you get lonely. I'm not surprised you're going to get lonely. You know, your boyfriend's dead. So it's probably not going to get any better anytime soon. But on the flip side to that, you're going to be dead soon as well. So, yeah, you know, eh? Eh? Not all bad. We need to go back in. Right, dig your own grave and save, I guess. Um, was there anything in our lab that was locked? Don't think so. I guess we can have a look. I'm sure, I'm sure something around here was locked. Maybe not in our lab, but somewhere. Nothing in there. Um... I guess we can drop a save, I suppose, in case we fuck things up. Let's be honest, if we can fuck things up, we will. That's kind of how we roll. emulator I'm pretty sure we still have to manage our memory cards we, we have four of them I think which sounds like a lot but Dreamcast games really do eat memory cards at least a lot of them do. right let's start storing these because you know they're only like basic ass ones anyway but yeah that's fine Right, okay. Now let's go see if there's any other um, labs we can raid. I'm sure there was another thing that would do with that key. No time to waste here. There's no time to waste in the second lab, but we can waste as much time as we want in the third. That actually says thirst lab. It doesn't say third lab. Third. Thirst. Three ST. I mean, hey, sure, why not? Uh, messy desk. Not that messy. Jesus. Be my desk sometimes. Right, well, there's sweet FA here. Yeah, I guess they're researching HIV. I actually talked to a bloke. Uh, he's the chap that I see quite often. He's the he's Cornwall's longest survivor of HIV. Really interesting chap. Uh, got sexually assaulted when he was very young, and then stabbed with a needle. Um, you can Google him. I always chat to him. He's done a lot for the HIV um, movement and all that kind of stuff, getting it more accepted. Blah blah blah. And um, he's in on a lot of like research firms and stuff and raises a lot of money. And uh, they've got to the point now where HIV apparently isn't the death sentence it used to be. I mean, you can have a proper full life with it. Nothing here. Um, and you can, if, I think he said when he first got HIV, he was taking like 40 pills a day. Back in the early, I can't remember if it was the late 70s or the early, um, I don't have to get that, or the early 80s. And yeah, I think he said he was 14 when it happened, or something. Uh, yeah, he was on like nearly 40 tablets a day. Now he takes, I think he says one tablet a day. And as long as he takes that tablet, he can't even pass the disease on. He seems to reckon within 10 years they would have uh, completely beaten him. It. It's pretty awesome. Right, well, I think we've done everything we can with this key. 
Which apparently wasn't that much, actually. I thought there was some extra things that we could actually do. Now, what's Chiefy going to do when he finds out that we've got the key? Now, remember, we're not actually allowed in this room. But we're going to be naughty anyway. We're going to go in here. Nope, doesn't open. Nothing in here. You sure? Move. Ah. Box. What in the world was Robert researching in this room? Uh, I don't know. That's what we're here to... Oh. Ah. Found the 8mm film. This is... Can it be the 8mm film? If I watch this, I will... Fine. In either case, I've come this far. I'll stick it through to the end. I have to find some place to see this. Uh, maybe the audio visual room? Just, you know, throwing it out there. Dang. We're going to end up as a patient downstairs, aren't we? What? Study on clairvoyance. Sure are weird books. The curse. This is a strange lab. This is a strange game, Meg. There are no relevant books. It's full of complicated books. You're a scientist, Meg. Are you? Surely complicated books shouldn't be an issue for you? I don't trust what Meg's selling, to be honest. I think she's full of shit. That's just me. Okay. Where's the security guard gone? He's just like disappeared. Right. Uh, we need to get into the audio visual room. Where the key to that be? Chief's office? But we've already been in the chief's office. Guess we can't just like ask him for it. Like, hey bro, can I like go and watch this dirty movie? Nope, nothing in the drawer. I literally have taken everything out of that drawer, even his sandwiches. Uh, very comfy looking leather sofas, to be honest. Keys to the audio visual room. I would bloody clue where that would be. We have to ask. We can go ask someone. Everyone's literally disappeared now. Um. Um, buddy, back. Go check. No. Does he have the key to the audio visual room? I'm looking for the AV key. Anybody seen the AV key? Anybody at all? Timothy's buggered off. I mean, there's no. Oh, the security room, maybe. Downstairs. Look at that possibly have the AV key? I mean, either that or the control room, but we had a good look around the control room. There's nothing there. Um, laboratory didn't have shit. Have a quick look, shall we? Just a quick little squiz, see what we can find. We could open that Oh no, we can open that one. That's the one with nothing in it. There's no, like, rabid monkey ready to jump out and eat our face or anything like that. No, nope, looks like we're going to go downstairs. If I get too stuck looking for this key, I can just thumb through that guide. Also, according to that guide, uh, I mean, I don't know how... <sighs> the scale on that guide's a bit weird, but... I don't think there's a lot of this game left, to be honest, but I guess we'll find out. Right, uh, audio visual room key. Go have a look. See if we can talk to the unit. The beefcake. Hopefully he doesn't like donkey punch us into oblivion. Crush our skull with his biceps. I don't know, maybe Meg's into that. I don't know. I'm not going to judge. I don't kink shame. Kitchen. Security.
Ah, he's not in here. Oh, yeah, there we go. Uh, not hiding in one of these lockers. Oh, so we're actually in the security room when we uh, go to the other side. Really? Really? All these keys? Huh. Okay. I really thought that was going to be it. Uh, maybe go back to the kitchen and ask the ladies if they're still there? Or the, the restaurant, I should say. Wow. It says restaurant there, but they call it a diner, so... I mean, they're just... I mean, look, ladies, is there really nothing to do here? Nope, they're not going to tell me Jack. I can't believe it wasn't in that... Um, in the security room. Oh, we can go to the kitchen then. Ooh. Anything in here? Huge kitchen. Oh, really? Look, again, there's loads of things that we can search with nothing in them. Like, why though? Why would you go to the effort of programming in, you know, interactable items that don't actually serve a purpose? Now, certain games like Clock Tower, I can understand it because you can use those uh, places to hide. But in this game, there's literally no reason or no point in any of it. Ugh, okay. But, you know, sure. Now, what's through this? Wait, is that the way we came in or did we come in the other way? We're almost out of time again. Didn't time fly when you're rummaging around the kitchen? Uh, okay. We still can't. Yeah, we can't go to the male toilets. Hmm. All right. Well, I'll tell you what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going <laughs> to end this video here. Um, I'm going to get out of this room. And when we come back, I'm going to read up and find out where we're supposed to be going next. I could run around and search, but. I can't be bothered. <laughs> I can't be asked to spend that sort of time on this game, if I'm being brutally honest. So I'm going to look it up. When we come back, we are uh, hopefully going to uh, get on with the story. I say story. Um, I'm being generous there, I think. I think you can agree I'm being generous there. But uh, till next time, guys. Thanks for watching.